Hey everybody, VT here with FXLiveDayTrading.com reviewing Friday's trade. I didn't get a chance to do it on Friday, so I'm doing it today. It's a holiday, Veterans Day, November 11th, 2013. And the chart here is right around noon time, Eastern Standard Time. Um, looking back on this chart um, would be Friday's trade that we took in non-farm payroll. Um, numbers came out, they weren't all that bad. We did have the euro dollar fall. Um, a Canadian dollar usually stays pretty steady with the US dollar. As a result, we did see the euro CAD come down just a wee bit. And the short was taken based on the 50 period moving average overhead resistance that really helped to cap this pair accordingly. We took the trade. We did break the 20 period on the way down, held it a bit, and then we ended up exiting about 139.85. The short was taken at 140.31. So we grabbed a nice amount of pips, uh, right around 45, 55 pips, really depending upon the, uh, the entry that you took. But needless to say, it was still a little bit uh, choppy overall markets. But that first move down off of the 50 here on that NFP announcement did allow us to wait. And we had plenty of time to go ahead and get our, um, our uh, initial target, which was the uh, stop run break on this 20 period moving average. So that's basically everything in a nutshell. Right now, I'm, I'm standing aside on this pair as we are now uh, making a way above the 4 hour 20 just kind of creeping up here. We're probably going to um, come up here to probably around that 140.80, 140.90 area, and that would be the 200, the retest of 200 period moving average. Now, today is a low volume day because we do have Veterans Day, so I would definitely be prudent today as you trade. Personally, I'm not trading anything, and I am flat today, and I'll be back in the uh, trading room tomorrow morning at uh, around 8.15 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, and I hope everybody enjoys their holiday today. Have a good one.